So hello, welcome to Eternal Velocity again. I've just gone and got the shop in and uh, in Tesco's car park. And uh, it doesn't, it's raining, but it doesn't stop car meets happening. Look at these bad boys. So what have we got here? Got a must, two Mustangs. No. Nah. <laughs> Ford. See the check out the tail pipes on this. <laughs> Get the tail pipes on this. There we go, that's what we like. <laughs> Uh, looks like an old blues mobile, this one. Apparently there's 50 odd coming to this meet today. Oh, yeah, for a little on We all good guys, thumbs up. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, another one coming behind me. <laughs> They're giving me a wave. Another one here. Oh, it's tipping down now. They're still arriving. Apparently all going to Albra today. Making their way for some fish and chips. 50 car trail. Hello, <laughs> you all right? Gonna look forward to your fish and chips later in this weather. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> What's this you got here? Uh, Ford F165. Ford F165. Yeah, lovely thing. We've got the tarp on the back. Hello there, you're right. <laughs> lovely looking machine. Look at these tail pipes down here. <laughs> look at them. Got a load to the ground now. <laughs> Got air ride, bit of air ride. <laughs> Lovely looking machine. Buick 8. So we're getting a bit wet now, but this is pretty cool. Getting a little bit wet now. Everyone seems to be rather happy as well. <laughs> so that's cool. Little Jag. I don't know if he's part of the meet. <laughs> but, uh, but we're getting waves off everyone. So, um, yeah. So anyway, that was it. Uh, I'm not part of the meet, unfortunately. I've just literally turned up here and uh, seen all these lovely cars. And now I'm actually soaked, but uh, but yeah, love cars, any cars, love them. <laughs> See you later.
where this is uh, smashed into the frame here. All the ball bearings have come loose. That's one. That's two. Three. Four. Five. Here's the last one. Look at this. It's part of the outer casing. It's meant, it's meant to be over here somewhere. And all the ball bearings meant to sit in these holes. Where's the rest of it gone? Literally nothing else left in there. Wow, bit of a mess up here. Gonna have to uh, clean that up a little. I do wonder where the other ball bearings gone. I'm sure there's six. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's six. I will just count how many I've got in the for the replacement. It's interesting. Ma magic. Maybe that's where the ball bearings gone. That's uh, shot out there. That's what that would be, wouldn't it? Because that's like ball bearing size. So perhaps the ball bearing just shot out. Yeah, look, see that's holding it there, look. So that's gonna, yeah, so we, one of the ball bearings are gone somewhere. I'm left at the Nürburgring. I've got to take this off. I've got to undo all these now. Take that bit off, put on the new bit. Put the drive shaft back in. And then hopefully, We'll have a working car again. But we shall see. at all so it's sheared off all the way around so this bit is sheared off and absolutely obliterated and escaped somehow because I was just I was like how the hell because they're different heights but you get right down they're different heights as well and I'm like how's that happen so um yeah that's amazing. I don't understand how it's happened, but uh, interesting. Well, look at what we have here, just getting the, the boot off the drive shaft. And uh, look. That was in there. <laughs> it's the missing piece. The missing piece to the monstrosity over there <laughs> so uh, yeah that's hence why the uh, size difference so, uh, that pile of shit can go over there somewhere so we have the full story now it's just sheared off so uh, anyway right I'm gonna carry on I'm gonna get a new 
boot on here. I'm going to put this new um, thing. Uh, I don't even know what you call it. Cog or something. I don't know. Uh, onto there, so that will go on there. Um, then put the boot over with a bit of grease in it as well. Uh, and then try and put this thing all back together with all the ball bearings in. We'll see how that goes. That's probably going to be a bit tricky. And then seat it back in the hole. Back in there, which I've cleaned up. So, which looks okay in there. Um, can't see any damage, but we'll see. Um, so, yeah, we're getting there. Yeah. So, luckily, I've got another part. Look, look at this. It should be crisp and clean like this one. This is taking a hammer in just here and down there. But yeah, um, so yeah, we need to take this off as well. Uh, luckily, I've got a toolkit to get the, uh, the clip off it because it's alright. There's a little clip just here. Um, I'll get that off before I can take this bit off. So, uh, but I've got a toolkit now, so I should be able to do that. Um, and then we'll get the boot off. Put a new one on. Uh, just in case that's leaking any oils, we'll take that off, replace that, and uh, then we'll start um, putting it back together. everything up. Well first thing so we've got we got gears. That's good. Door open. Now the door's open. There we go. Well, that feels okay. That's alright. something under my foot. What's that? I think that's just a bit of trim from a... Uh... Oh yeah, it's just a bit of trim from down, down the bottom of the uh, central pillar. Oh, ducks crossing the road, don't want to splat them. Come on, get out of the road, duckies. There we go. 